Hey guys, um, I would like to show you how I put on the sling and uh, I have Mateo here. <gasps> Say hello. Hey. Hello. Hey. Hey. If you are not familiar with it, is this really long piece of clothing here. It's very, very useful. If I could recommend one thing for when you have a baby, this is the best purchase we've ever made. So um, we're pretty happy with it. Uh, it looks a little tricky at the beginning when you try to put it all around yourself, but it's actually quite simple. So I'm going to show you. And um, okay, here we go. Okay, so this thing, uh, first of all, you have to find the middle which in this case is the sticker, the label. Uh, so you got your middle here. You kind of do like this. And you go like this all around your waist. And you cross it and you bring it up to your shoulders. Now you have the two extremes here. You cross it once and you put them underneath like this and then you cross them again like so now I'll turn around you do this and then you bring it again in front of you you tie a knot and you tie another knot and a double knot. I do a double knot in the back. So, so you have these two like this. And this one here, which I'll show you in a minute um, what it's for. They call it the seat belt. And you'll know why. So I'm going to go get the baby and I'll show you how to put your baby in. Say hello. Hello, you two. Hello. <laughs> okay, so here you can see me. So you take the baby facing you, always facing you, and you take one side and you put his leg, there you go, on one of the holes. There you go. And then you take the other leg, like so, and you put it like this, and now you have to see the one that is inside, you kind of have to make it nice and comfy for him, so I like to kind of fold it, like stretch the fabric, and sorry that's wrong because I'm looking at the camera, this one under would go first, and then you stretch it to make it more comfortable for him. And then you pull it over like this. There you go. So this is not completely safe. And this is when the seat belt comes into place. The seat belt is this one that you have underneath. You put your legs, sorry, the baby's legs. Legs would be tricky. <laughs> the baby's legs under it. And then you pull it up like so. See? And now, ta-da! Yeah, see? Say hi. I'm very comfy in here, mommy. Uh. Yeah, yeah. So this is how I wear Mateo on the sling. Uh, there are many ways of carrying your baby in the sling. We found that this was the most comfortable way, and he really likes it the most. He's really comfortable. He's his back is supported. His feet are here, like this, so he's very comfortable. He literally falls asleep on here every time we put him in. We discover when, since he was very little, that he really didn't care for the push chair or the, the baby buggy, but he really loves this thing. And he's now three and a half months old and he still uses it and it's really the most comfortable thing for him. And uh, He's with you, he he can 
he can smell you, he can feel you, and he's really, really comfortable in this thing. I don't know if you are familiar with the slings, but um, they've saved uh, they saved our lives the first three months. It really, really helps a lot surviving those first few weeks, and and now we keep using it because it's just he really likes it. Um, I don't know when the baby gets heavier if I will still wear him like this. Um, uh, I kind of like it, and I find it a lot um, easier to carry than, yeah, than carrying like a pushing a you know a, a baby push chair. So, yeah, we like it. I wanted to show you. <laughs> He's looking at the camera. Hey, and uh, let me know if you use the sling, if you like it, if you have other ways to put your baby in. Uh, you can also front face him, but uh, um, I was told that it's not a good idea. They they uh, they rather be looking at you and they need to have their bottom kind of sitting on the sling which is a lot more comfortable so um, so I think this is the best position for them when they're really little there's a different way to to put them in but uh, he's kind of grown out of that so uh, this is how we wear him every day and he loves it I'm Mateo yeah Mwah. So that was it. That's all I wanted to show you guys. So uh, I will see you tomorrow in our next vlog. Okay. Bye. Bye. Say bye bye. Bye. Hey guys. I forgot to tell you once you put on the sling, I recommend that you start walking because uh, babies don't like to be still on the slings. They, they want you to start walking and uh, to stay active with the thing. So right now I have a really big mess in the kitchen. <laughs> like you can see after dinner so uh, we are going to clean it up that's the good thing about this thing you you can actually you can wear them and you can walk around and that's kind of what they like they like to they like to be moving they like to be bouncing they like the, the really bouncy and uh, the movement that you can do with the sling uh, and uh, it's right now it's about 8:30 or so and it's late and he's getting a little cranky if you if he's not in the sling he starts complaining and eventually maybe I can show you later but he falls asleep uh, and I can put him in bed so it's the best way to to deal with that you know end of the day kind of um, <laughs> irritable baby <laughs> that you normally get I'm sure I'm not the only one so it's uh, it's a good idea to put him on the sling and just go about your day. Uh, just you know, go run some errands if you have to, or clean the dishes, or do laundry, or hey, there you go, he's uh, spinning a little bit, eh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You gonna spit for YouTube? There you go. Okay, well, that was that. He he just uh, had dinner, so. You know, a little back came back. <laughs> so, yeah, just go about your day and uh, wear your baby and he will he will love it. Um, I can assure you that all babies like this thing and it's uh, it really is a lifesaver. But uh, I'm going to go and clean up my kitchen and I'll see you guys later. Bye.